should I not be talking? No, go ahead. Can I talk now? Yeah, you can. One of the things I like with My Hero specifically in terms of these, like, there's a villain, and then there's a villain behind the villain, and then there's a villain behind the villain, and you can go, like, layers and layers for Same thing some with the heroes, the too, ones. which is kind of funny. Yeah, but I find, the, and this might be just me personally, I find the villains to be more, like, the, the reasons people... I like stories of a fall, right? It's why Lucifer is my favorite character in everything ever. Because I don't know how you get to be a bigger fall from grace than that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> um, so that's probably just the story I'm drawn to. Because you're right. And All Might stands, be, you know, Midoriya, All Might. The generations uh, of, you know, yeah, yeah. Shimura, and on and on and on behind him, them, right? But with, uh, with Shigaraki... And I hate, I cannot express how deeply I hate him. (laughs) He's a good character, but I despise him. Um, And it loops really, uh, it loops really neatly into, like, the heroes, right? Mm -hmm. (laughs) And the way all of this falls back and and ultimately all for one is behind everything, right? But you get behind the layer of Shigaraki, and behind that layer is his father's abuse, right? Mm Mm-hmm. Um, and then you get behind that layer of his father's abuse, and it's, it's, uh, Shimura choosing to, you know, um, give him up for adoption because of the danger she was in as the wielder of... All, uh, all, all, one, one f- no, one for all, all. yeah, one for all. Right? Yep. And the reason she's in danger... <laughs> as the wielder of one for all is because of all for one. Yep. And the reason she, so the, I don't know. Yeah. I lost my train of thought there. It's gone. But I like it. It's, it's, I I guess domino effect, right? All of these dominoes have fallen in this way and they explain why Shigaraki's ended up the way he has. But I don't care. To a degree. Uh, Yeah. He's still a piece of shit. None of this is, an excuse for you know everything he's done and or even like apologetic about what he's done because i'm not he's a piece of shit and i i but, uh, hate him not as a character but as a character i'm supposed to hate right and yeah. um toya is the same thing once you uh, endeavors endeavors redemption is similar right you think you're starting with Endeavor's Redemption and this is going to be, like, an upward thing. And for him, probably, right? But you keep peeling it back <laughs> and you yeah. find all the awful all the ways skeletons his previous... And, you know, yeah, the and how it, it continues to affect. So with Dobby, you peel it back and you get, you know, that awful shit he went through as, in, you know, as Endeavor's first son and all the issues related to that. I don't know. No, yeah. I mean, that's why I like it. I don't really root for villains. I'm usually not that. Type I don't of either. None of it excuses. But I will say, like, I, I want Dobby to like either of their actions. But like, just I... as you're starting to see Endeavor, you know, Endeavor's family is starting to kind of come around a little bit. The next eldest brother that's still alive, whose name escapes me. Um, is like is really struggling with it much more so you know the they oldest daughter the is is open and, and she wants that really ready for it she really wants a cohesive family unit good yep. for her i'm glad she's in there yep um todoroki is coming around to it he's on to, the fence yeah due to his you know uh midoriya's yeah, influence the, and oh. all these friends and his experiences he's kind of accepting that this is part of him Mm -hmm. Um, no matter, you know, regardless of of what he thinks of it, this is a part of him, but it's him, and he has control over that piece, you know? Yep. Um, and the older brother that I said was was really, like, struggling with it, right? Yep. And it's almost at that peak of the struggle where you think he might, like, just the, the barest, the tiniest little glimpse that he might... Come around. Come around, or, or... You know, he storms out, right? And then, like, the whole bottom just fucking drops out of the whole goddamn thing with with a bunch of stuff that I can't say to you because it would be spoilers. Well. And just shows you, like, the depth of those, those repercussions for, you know, turns out abusing your family for, like, decades in your pursuit for your singular goal 
that cannot be reached and you're aware of the gap between you know where you are now and the the impossibility of reaching that goal but you still try anyway and you put all these close people to you that you're supposed to love through absolute hell to try and achieve that because that doesn't mean as much to you their happiness doesn't mean as much to you as that ultimate goal and then uh and then it gets snatched away out of your eyes and is completely unattainable <laughs> forever uh, and there's nothing you can do about that. So now you're like, oh, man, well, th these people were second on my list of priorities. Maybe we circle back around to it there. And that's the problem I, ha I uh... have with the redemption arc is it doesn't feel like this is a man that seriously want wants redemption. It's someone who, well, this first one's now impossible, so I guess I'll try to make amends for all the bad shit I did. Yep. And, like, and then it turns out you can't you don't get to be a piece of shit for that long without some serious lifelong repercussions yeah no i i mean i i say this with all <laughs> honestly i hope he gets worse i hope he gets what he's coming to and worse and i i know i shouldn't say that but oh well i don't think it will just because of the the nature of the a nature shonen of, yeah and a, and, a super and i would say stream pretty light shonen well that and i don't know Japanese storytelling like, too, kind of like family is very important too. Like, yeah, I know that's kind of a little bit more so, and I would say in European culture in general too. Oh, in Japan. In Japan and European culture, is family is very important, right? Um, <clears throat> doesn't mean that your father yeah, should be allowed to be family, abusive, but family's been a theme throughout my hero. Definitely, yeah. The whole Shimura mom and, Shigaraki, and not even just that Hiroki, Deku's his mom. Deku and his mother, and Otaku her struggling, and her, parents her and... struggling with the first thing of being like, ah, oh, you don't have a quirk, and technically, genetically, it's my fault, that, and I'm that sorry. That and... to make me angry at the way they handled it, and yeah, I, that's I a recognize whole different... it as like a scar from the the altered direction the story had to take, but it will never not be irritating to me. Yeah, I, I told you I watched the first episode several times because I was trying to do that voice acting thing. Yeah, yeah. And seeing how how much that was painted, how much that emotional strength was put in that to that I'm so sorry, you could tell, even in the anime where they knew they weren't going to go around this direction, that that was supposed to mean more. That whole line of, like, can I be a hero without a quirk? No. And the answer yeah, is not. no. <laughs> you cannot. You need a quirk. Mandatory. Pre-rec. All you, you quirk, other quirkless fools out there, sucks to suck. Yeah. Oh, man. My hero is fun, though. You know? It is fun. You know I can fucking yeah, talk yeah, about it, it for five uh, years. We only talk about it because we enjoy it. But yeah, I, I seriously like the original idea that you found a lot I better. But, yeah. I think a lot of those scars, you don't see them so much anymore, but in the beginning they were absolutely... And can you imagine... Not Midoriya to... even says in this line, that's not what I needed you to say, Mom. By the way, when, yeah, like, like, you well, know... Well, she was right, bitch! <laughs> yeah. She was right! You were wrong! Suck it! Like, what? <laughs> what? You gonna go out there? Honestly, Midoriya. Put Midoriya now, age him um, a decade, right? Or two. Yeah. And put him at All Might's age, right? Uh -huh. And I want you to sit there and tell me he says straight face to a kid without a quirk who asks him that same exact question. Can you be that a he quirk can be a hero. a hero? Well, yeah, the answer that even All Might gave him was no. here, here, eat my pubes. Go be a police officer. No, he didn't say that. That's illegal. Oh, sorry. Here, <laughs> have a piece of my hair. Because the answer is no, and this is how you get your quirk. Your mom was right, and she didn't want to build up your hopes for a future that you could not have, and that you would not have had if you weren't the main character in this anime and ran into All Might as he was happened to be back in town to take a teaching position in UA to, look to for find a successor. a successor because he was so brutalized after his last fight from uh all for one. Yep. 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 Like the amount of, of pure fucking luck lottery. So I want you, I want Midoriya's character to like somebody to tell me with a straight face that Midoriya's character would sit there and tell that to a quirkless I was quirkless once, is probably what he'd say. And now he's got, like, a dozen, so... Yeah, and more. But that's uh, newer directions, yeah. 
I don't know. I love Batman Midoriya so much more than I... uh, Can I just say, the... And not to veer into my own personal uh, pet characters uh, in My Hero, but I'm about to veer into my own personal pet characters in My Hero. Uh... Can you imagine, look through the, at the strife, the, the typical rival strife that Bakugo's going through as, it, it's like Naruto, Sasuke, right? Like Yeah, except I'm better. I'm baller, and I'm so much fucking better than you, and you can't do anything, yeah. right? Uh, except then that character that was so far behind makes all those strides, and not only catches up, but surpasses in some ways, right? Yeah. Now, I want you to picture that. That's with a quirk. Can you imagine... <laughs> Without a quirk, and without that support from All Might behind him, Bakugo in the same position. Where someone's catching, or this guy is catching him right now, him or in surpass- some ways. Then he without a quirk. Then he joins the League of Villains. That's a whole new fucking character. It's true. Genuinely, I don't yeah. think he joins the League of I'm, Villains. I'm I kidding, think that's too way. ingrained in him. Uh, but uh, uh, yes, I'm kidding. Upon a- knowing his family now, I understand why we didn't have a Sasuke moment. That's a whole but. yes. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. that's a whole new character, right? Like, yeah, yeah, 100%. I, I, I... And you know what's funnier is Deku obviously being a whole new character in this scenario, too. But I think that gives him confidence. Imagine your whole entire life being quirkless, but you want to be a superhero, knowing you have to, like, bat... Like, yeah, right now, this, Deku like, cool, is, like, this master. transcended power. I don't know how to do it. And then, like, he's trying to learn this shit. But once you start taking down villains without a quirk... And you'd be like, you know you're behind? It's not yes. that Batman That's level of fucking, fucking confidence. You want Beacon of Hope? That's Beacon of Hope for everybody that doesn't fucking have a quirk. You got a quirk, you're even, you you can do even better, right? And that Batman but stance be- too, by the way. This actual stance, and I'm not a huge Batman stand, but with the league, says, like in the Batman Justice stand. League, well, I'm a Nightwing fan. I, Bruce Wayne can go I fuck know, himself. Know, know, but uh, in the Justice League, he goes, I, I should be the weakest member here. I know. Everyone here has these abilities that should be better than me, and yet they're not. That, like, that type of confidence. <laughs> what could have been. Yeah, that would have been sick. That would have been sick. I'll grant you that. All right, end of episode one.